Marched by Robert Sheldon begins with a bold processional full of dignity and character. Clarinets majestically perform the melody, which is passed along to other sections of the band. This song ends with a regal flourish that begins this song to a close. We give you March of the Majestic. derives its name from one of the most major battles fought in the 15th century near the site of Megiddo, in the Jezreel Valley in Syria. It was fought between the ancient Egyptians and a large Canaanite collision led by King Kadesh. This battle is the first recorded battle in history with relatively reliable details since it was recorded in the hieroglyphics. These hieroglyphics tell us that the day this battle began was the 21st day of the first month of the third season of the year 23 of the reign of Pharaoh Thutmose the third. Sources claim that this date would have been April 16, 1457 BC. The Egyptians were victorious over the Canaanite forces in this battle. Once the Canaanites lost, they fled to safety in the city of Megiddo. In order to give this song the, its Egyptian feel, the composer Jack Wilds wrote the song based off the Freudian model scale. In this scale, the second, third, sixth, and seventh scale degrees are lowered to give it this ancient feel. The song begins with quiet mystery and swells to create the anticipation of the battle to come. We hope a performance of Jack Wilde's Megiddo takes you back in history. So with Megiddo, as you heard there, this is an ancient battle. When you listen to the beginning of the composition, imagine that you're on your camel, going to this ancient city, Megiddo, and then at one point, see if you can hear where the gates open, all right? And the battle begins, and then listen to the composition, and as you're listening, you'll hear in the middle, there's interactions between the melody being played, and that's the battle. That's the different fighting going on, right? And then there's a, it, it all has a, come to a climax at the end. Right? So this is kind of like a little mini novel for you here in bed, so sit back and listen and enjoy.
suggest, in this quiet place is a quiet and reflective piece. This lyrical song requires the band to perform expressively in order to project its light and gentle feel to the song. Composer Robert Sheldon is one of the most performed composers in modern band. He understands how to embody a level of expression that resonates with the ensembles and audiences alike.
have no idea how they memorize that. I'm a band director and I have no idea how they memorize that. <laughs> All right, awesome. Hey, gentlemen, you forgot something. Drummers. <laughs> yeah, you guys know what I'm talking about, right? Band rehearsal's over and everybody else puts their instruments away and I go back in the percussion section and I look, there's drumsticks, there's a tambourine. You know, you post big signs on the walls. Put your instruments away. They don't read a single one of them. Levante, you forgot something, right? How about one more round of applause?